Hi, thanks for checking out Video Notebook. If the Video Notebook extension is installed in your browser, it will show this VN button in the upper right corner of videos on websites on our list of approved domains, YouTube, Udemy, Coursera, and others. Also, if you're in a Google Meet meeting, which I'll go to here and open this up, you'll see the VN icon again in the upper right uh, of the browser tab so you can take notes on Google Meet meetings. But now uh, we're going to look at a YouTube video. This is a UCSF medical school lecture. I can click on this VN button at any time to open the VN window to start taking screenshots or notes. In the meantime though, our AI is watching the video. When I start playing it, you'll see the AI is watching the video. And uh, the VN icon just changed to this uh, sparkle. That's an AI uh, notification. And it opens the VN window and it says click to view AI content. So I can click this and I can see that it's grabbed a screenshot automatically and uh, also added a note. So I can click this button to hide it again or to show it so um, I can hide the AI content at any time. So check out this button here. I can uh, change AI content settings. Essentially I can always show AI notes for uh, a YouTube category. Uh, I can show, always show AI notes for a, a website like Udemy or Google Meet um, so that I don't have to turn this on in order to see the AI, AI notes. See that for each screenshot or note there is a timestamp here. If I click on this timestamp I can go right to that point and start the video from there. Also you can take your own screenshots and text notes. I can click on this camera button to add a screenshot or I could type Alt S. So I'll do that. Actually I'll, I'll move the, the cursor so it's somewhere else. I'll type Alt S here. And I took that screenshot. I'll stop the video. Um, note that any screenshot, any image, you can click on this icon and then you can annotate it. bigger or smaller, so forth. I can also take text notes. Uh, I can click here to add a note or I can uh, type Alt Z and add a text note. And once again, note that we've got a, we've got a timestamp every time we add any kind of note. Check out this menu in the upper right corner. I can Click here to change the name of the video. We grab the, the video name from YouTube. We can change the notebook. Notebooks are containers like folders. And I'm going to move this to fun stuff. I can go to a help notebook which has videos uh, that explain uh, tutorials on different things about video notebook. I can see what's new in this version. I can move, uh, dock the VN window to another part of the screen. For instance, the, the, the lower right. Now look at these two very important buttons in the upper left. I can uh, click this to go to notes, but right now I just want to first show share notes. So I can type email addresses in here. I can click share and email will be sent, or I can copy a link and I can drop that link in a social media uh, site like Twitter, or I can uh, send a text message with this link to this to my notes for this video and the video as well. But this is a really important button. This button enables me to go to the web app. So I'll click here. Uh, this is app.videonotebook.com and it has uh, notes about this video. So it has um, all the notes that we were taking before. I can, once again, uh, this is the, the video uh, from YouTube and I can click here and start the video from that point. Um, I can annotate it uh, once again. Um, I can also search to find a particular point in the video where a word was mentioned. Um, and uh, here I can export this, uh, this video page to a PDF file or a markdown file. Um, I can also share again. But this is really important. Um, you want to go to your, your web app uh, to uh, look at all of your notes for all your videos. Um, and uh, you can see here I've got lots and lots of videos here, um, light style and atrial fibrillation, so on and so forth. I can click on 
the notebook title and see thumbnails of all the different videos. I can search across all those different videos and uh, find videos that have a certain word, um, and, or I could copy a public URL. And when I copy the public URL, what I'm doing is I'm, I can send that to somebody so they can see all of the videos when all the notes within a particular notebook. The Video Notebook extension helps you take notes on online videos and meetings using both AI and your own notes. Then the Video Notebook web app helps you organize these videos so you can study them efficiently. Video Notebook, visual notes for visual thinkers.